Wake up with Matt in the morning. Oh, hey. Matt here from Matt in the morning once again. So, first of all, thanks for waking up with me. Uh, today's video we're doing is going to be armadillo eggs round two. We're using a different pepper, different meat in this one. Um, I just really, I just wanted to show just a different variation on armadillo eggs. Because uh, again, there's 50 million point two three four divided by eight ways to do it. Um, so yeah, that's all we're doing today. We're doing armadillo eggs. If you've seen the first video, it's going to be very similar, just with different ingredients. Um, and feel free to switch it up any way you like. And if there's a certain way you'd like me to try it, drop it down in the comments. I'll try it out. Um, I could be the test dummy for anything food related, and we'll do a video on it. So let me know if there's something specific you want to see. So yeah, and in the future we'll probably do some more armadillo eggs with just different ways to do it. A friend of mine, Christina, wants me to try one with an egg inside of the jalapeno. So we're going to try that one day soon. So anyways, hope you enjoyed the video. Um, be sure to subscribe down below. I'm sure you already have, but if you haven't, hit that subscribe button. Um, and if you like this video, give me a thumbs up, like it, share it, tweet it, Instagram it, Facebook it, LinkedIn it. You can LinkedIn it. Anyways, I hope you enjoy it. Let's go down to the kitchen. Hey guys, we're back and we're doing armadillo eggs again because they're great. This time we're doing a little bit different of a variation. The ingredient list will be down below in the description. Uh, what we're doing this time is... 50-50 blend of meat again. We're doing half ground beef, half hot Italian sausage. Uh, and the pepper we're using, we're not using a jalapeno this time. We're actually using one of those little mini sweet, uh, I'll show you, using one of those little mini sweet peppers. Um, and then we're just stuffing it with cream cheese and we mixed in some diced green chilies with that. Um, so anyways, I've got them all pre-made here except for one. I'll show you doing one. And again, everything else is the same. We're gonna core it, we're gonna stuff it, we're gonna wrap it with our meat mixture, we're gonna wrap that in bacon, and then we're putting it on a preheated pellet grill at 250 degrees for two hours. Take them off, sauce them up with your favorite barbecue sauce, back on at 400 degrees for about 15 minutes. Take them off, let them rest, and then eat them. So let's go ahead and get to wrapping our final one. So again, this is a 50-50 blend, ground beef and hot Italian sausage. You can do whatever you want. We're just gonna wrap that like so. I like to roll it a little bit. Oh, and we also put that Trinity blend on it. You know I'm putting that Trinity on everything. Everything. Boom, egg. Then we're simply taking our bacon and unfortunately, I bought cheap bacon. I don't know if there's a such thing as cheap bacon, but anyways, there you go. It's not a very pretty one, but there's an armadillo egg. So at this point, we're gonna go ahead and uh, just take them on out to the grill. Uh, again, preheated at 250 degrees for two hours. Once I close that lid, I'm just setting the alarm for two hours and I'm not touching them. See you in a minute. All right, guys, it's been two hours. Just pulled these things off, ready to sauce them. Um, it's it's preheating right now to 400 degrees. So let's go ahead and get these things sauced up. And I'm just using some Sweet Baby Ray's Honey Chipotle, kind of my go-to. Uh, you know, we use those on the ribs, if you've seen that video. If you haven't, go ahead and check that out when this one's done. Um, this is really just a good all-around go-to barbecue sauce. Uh, the chipotle adds a little bit of, a little bit of kick. The honey's got some sweetness, really good. And you can tell, look, these uh, these armadillo eggs are just right. Now some of them aren't the prettiest, um, but the bacon wasn't really, the bacon wasn't hitting on all cylinders. Um, but you know, that's okay. The, 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 they're still going to taste good. 
So all we're gonna do is sauce these on both sides, of course. Get this brushed on here. And as soon as this grill's preheated to 400, I'm gonna toss it back on for 15 minutes. And at that point, we'll go ahead and take them off and cut one open and see what it looks like. So yeah, we'll see you here in a minute. All right, here we go. I wasn't going to show these puppies on the grill. Oh man, but look at that. Don't mind them drippings on the bottom. That tin foil will get changed out. Look at that, beauties. I'm just gonna simply take them off here and get them inside. Let's see, uh, let's see what these things look like. All right guys, we're back in the house. Got all the armadillo eggs in. Let's go ahead and cut this thing open and see what it looks like. It smells delicious, it looks delicious. And my gosh, it is going to taste delicious. So not sure if you can see on that camera, the smoke ring. Don't know if you can tell. Ooh, get it in the right spot. So there you go. These things are delicious. Let's do a little bit of sriracha. And some people don't like it, but I do. So a little bit of cilantro. Why not? I like it. If you don't, that's okay. Don't put it on there. So there we have it. Armadillo eggs, just a different, different way of doing them. Uh, you, there's 50 million ways to do it. I could have a whole YouTube channel just on armadillo eggs, uh, but we won't do that. So anyways, hope you enjoyed this video. If it was helpful to you at all, give it a thumbs up, comment, share it, uh, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Uh, that's, that's the number one thing to do. That way you can see all my videos I'm coming out with on a weekly basis. Uh, we got some good stuff in store coming up. Uh, one thing I, I do want to give a little hint about, um, if you've watched the video this far, I think you deserve to get a hint of coming up, we're going to smoke water. Water. You'll find out why in a later video. So stay tuned for more. Thanks for watching.